Good morning, friends. Today we are going to do an experiment with coloring, milk, and some dish soap. So what you're going to need is a paper plate. <clears throat> you are going to pour some milk in it. You need a little shallow plate and just pour milk into it. Just like that. And you want to let it sit for about 10 seconds because you want it to stop moving because when you pour the milk it's spreading but you want it to be motionless so we count to 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and that has stopped moving and you want to add a couple of drops of food coloring into it drop here a drop here, different food color, different colors. Drop here, and yellow one here. You are going to take a Q-tip or a cotton swab, dip it in some dish soap. You don't want it to be drenching, just a little bit, not a whole lot. And if it's too much, just wipe it on the side of the bowl. And Put it into where the food coloring is and watch it spread. Ready? See that? Now that what is happening is the soap is breaking up the oil, the fat, and the surface tension that is in the milk. You know how when you're washing your hands and you have grease on them? So you need soap for them to wash it away. So this is what's happening here. Now, if you can also use your fingers. You can dip your finger into the dish soap and put it on the, where the color is and watch it spread and watch. See, the colors are mixing into each other, just like that. Isn't that cool? You can use more food color in here to get more color. So if you want to do it again and again, you have to use new milk. Look at that. Wash your plate and do it again and again. And once you create this beautiful marble surface, what you can do is get a piece of paper and put it on top of the plate and kind of pat gently. Gentle, gentle, gentle. This would be a great outdoor activity. And pick it up and you have some marble artwork. See? And you can create different designs every time. Have a great day and I'll see you later. Bye.